Folks, your Pratt Pack getting just about ready to leave. Been a long day again, but definitely worth it. I love hanging out with labor, and that's good union labor, and the people at the Keystone Mountain Lakes Regional Council of Carpenters. And as I said earlier this morning, my father would have been 90 years of age today. He loved good union labor, and for many years with the Zinc Corporation Horsehead, which their corporate headquarters is still here in Robinson Township, happens to be the site where they're building the new Shell petrochemical plant. But Rick Rokrzewski, 40 years laboring to make it better for the American worker. Here's his father, Vance. He, too, a carpenter who worked for that great Kaufman's department store name for a number of years. And Tommy is shooting this. He, of course, the pride of Duquesne Heights, another card-carrying member of the great union labor that is the Keystone Mountain Lakes Regional Council of Carpenters. And you know, I talk a lot about legacy and history and life and what really someone leaves behind. And it's all about faith and family and that body of work, and especially people that work with their hands. And my good friend, John Diagardi from Rome Monument, of course, his father, Vince, have always talked about what they do as far as the skilled labor, taking that marble and turning it into a piece of history. And yes, that little dash between the year you're born and the year you die. That dash really is kind of your life. And so let me read this for you before we say goodnight. The dash between. I knelt there at the headstone of one I loved and cried, named with dates of birth and death, were perfectly inscribed. I ponder these two dates on how little they both mean when they compare to the tiny dash that lies there in between. The dash serves an, as an emblem of our time here on earth, and although small it stands for all, our years of life and worth. And our worth will be determined by how we live each day. We can fill our dash with goodness or waste our life away. To ourselves as well as others, let's be honest, kind and true, and every day live the way we know God wants us to. May we look for opportunities to deal with a worthy deed and reach out with compassion to those who are in need. For if our hearts are full of love throughout our journey here, we'll be loved by all who know us and our memory they hold dear. And when we die, these memories will bring grateful, loving tears to all whose lives were touched by the dash between our years. And as you can hear in the background, a loved one trying to reach these great workers on their smartphone. So it's time for us to say goodnight. And to my father and my mother, whose birthday would have been this Saturday, I love you both. Thank you for the great Catholic faith and, more importantly, the faith in humanity. Good night from the Keystone Mountain Lakes Regional Council of Carpenters. So long from your Pratt Pack.